A lot of people hate numbers. Maybe it's some uh, disposition that they had when they were in school <laughs> and had bad grades in their math classes. But actually, even I myself, I'm not really fond of looking through numerous financial reports to understand the company. But financial facts are important because when you look at the company and you just look at their, at their products and at their management team and maybe other things about that company, maybe industry reports, you get one thing not that is really important for you. You don't get any relationship between what you're actually buying and how much you pay for it. So a stock may have a very, very good product, but actually it's so expensive that they are a bad investment. Or a stock may have a scandal in the newspaper where everybody turns away from that stock, but they still produce healthy returns. That could be a good buy. To make that easy for you, we have created the value rank. And that uses the most important financial metrics for any stock investor. It's the relationship between the size of the company and the price you pay for it. We measure the size of the company on the profit, the size of the profit, the size of the revenues, the size of the invested capital, and even the size of the dividend that goes out to you. We all consolidate in the value, all consolidate all this in the value rank of the company. So whenever you buy companies, be aware how good their value is compared to other investments you want to make. This is one of the most important financial metrics. You can also look, if you take our handbook, at the other two metrics that are important for you, which is growth and safety. But that's outside of the scope of this video. I wish you good luck with your own investment.